what is up welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'm gonna be doing this look right here for you guys i wanted to do a butterfly inspired look and you guys are gonna find out why in the video and also in today's video i did try out the new butterfly collection by colourpop i believe this already launched on november 21st so i mean i'm a little late but girl it's fine if you guys want to see how i achieved this look and also just hear the tea on this collection then make sure to go ahead and keep on watching also i did do a giveaway throughout this video watch through the entire video to see what it is that you're winning and how to to enter it's very simple very easy so i do suggest that you guys pay attention to that giveaway it is kind of small but i'm doing like more small giveaways in every other video if not every video i hope you guys like that little idea and it's just my way of giving back to you guys before we get started i do want to talk about lux sb for a quick second lux sb is usually known as a luxury scent box but now they go as lux sb and to give you guys a little bit more of a background they are located in california and they're one of the largest perfume subscription service available you get one perfume a month for just 15 dollars meaning all types of niche and designer brands as well what's really cool about lux sb is the simple fact that you get nine milliliters usually perfume subscription services only give eight milliliters so you're getting that extra milliliter niche fragrances are usually very expensive so i feel like this is a cool way to just try out a bunch of different kind of products and you are also saving money that way because you are trying out these perfumes and they do last you you can do like five sprays a day and these perfumes are very rich in scent so i doubt you even need like five sprays when it comes to me i love to put like just two or three and that just lasts me for the whole day and throughout the day i just get compliments on how i smell and it's that powerful so this will last you if you're thinking otherwise you're wrong not only do they provide niche fragrances but they also provide designer fragrances which is amazing so this is the perfume that you guys will be getting and i'm just gonna show you guys up close how i use it so to use it and to spray it you literally just twist super easy now to open and see your fragrance you literally just want to take it out just like that and here is your reusable glass vial and then every quarter you do get a new atomizer which is super cool i've been using this non-stop you can definitely tell it is all the way down here when speaking to lux sb i described the scents that i like and girl they got it spot on i'm literally obsessed with the smell like oh my god this case right here basically acts as an outer shell to protect your fragrance inside and the atomizer right here does come in different colors which is super cool super unique it adds a little fun and it's super inexpensive $15 for niche and designer fragrances is not that much it's way better than going out and buying a whole full bottle later on you're not using it and you're not liking the smell and stuff when you can literally try one every month for $15. You do have choices because they do have a $15 subscription service and then they have a $18 subscription service and that has exclusive scents that only premium members can get. So the choice is yours. Also with the premium service, you do get a case every single month. Unlike the regular one, you just get it quarterly. When you do get your package, this is what comes with it as well. It's basically a welcome card and on the back it shows you and tells you how to use your Lux SB which is super informative. Guess what? You can cancel at any time and there's also free shipping. I love me some free shipping and I know you guys do as well. So that is a plus when signing up to the subscription service. But like I said, this subscription service is $15 a month but I do have a promo code for you guys to use. If you use my promo code MUANIAs, your new total will be $9.75 plus free shipping, new customers only. Only, which is amazing how does it go from $15 to $9.75 on your first order that's a bargain that's a deal that's a steal I'll leave the promo code down below as well and also the website thank you to Lux SB for sponsoring today's video and now let's get on to this makeup look. Right, guys so we're just gonna get right into the video I already primed my eyes using the covergirl true blend undercover concealer which I talk about all the time this is it right here and I use it in the shade classic ivory which is L400 you guys know that I only use this to prime my eyes because the shades that they sent over was way too light but girl in today's video we're gonna go ahead and use the flutter by color pop palette 
when this palette came in me and my mom was in such awe this is the palette right here i'm in such awe like omg i wish you guys can feel it in person the butterflies are raised so you feel and you can see like the 3d effect of the butterfly like i didn't even want to touch this palette the packaging is everything and here is the palette like ColourPop does it every single time and I honestly don't know how and in today's video I'm also going to be using this ColourPop brush set that came with I think the bare essentials palette which I haven't tried yet either so I'm gonna go ahead and dip into the shade wild wing it's like a mauve light shade that's perfect for your transition shade especially if you're going in with like one of these darker shades over here on the ColourPop 115 brush and I'm gonna start by tapping this in since our base is wet we don't want to mess up what's under and mess up the consistency and pigmentation of the color once you have that laid down as you want it you're then gonna go ahead and start blending up and just diffusing that color all the way up um it's up to you i know some people like to drag it all the way up to their eyebrow but i personally don't i like to leave like a little nice clean spot right here near my eyebrow like i already told you guys the gradient and eyeshadows just turn me on also these brushes are really good they're fluffy they're just like everything i look for in a brush i've never found my color pop brushes um what's that word shedding yeah i never found my color pop brushes shedding at all so that's a really good thing about their brushes that they don't shed and i've never had a color pop like brush break on me yet so the next shade i'm gonna go into is this one right here which is called angel baby and i'm taking this on the color pop e19 brush i love this brush it's my first day using it but i can tell that this is like something that i look for when i tell you guys to go in with smaller brushes i love this brush you guys really need to get your hands on it so this right here was the transition brush and now i'm going in with this smaller brush right here which is perfect it's like a little pencil brush but it's very fluffy so it just works it just freaking works now i'm just putting that directly into my crease and i'm just gonna start blending away into that transition shade to get that gradient effect and I'm also just going to be winging this out. I want this look to be smoky. So that's what I'm doing by going out here and blending this out over here on the outer corner. I'm going to go back in with the same concealer and I'm just going to cut my crease halfway. I was so debating on doing a cut crease, but I was like, I don't know. I like to take this Luxie brush. This is the tapered angled blending shading maybe i don't know i can't really see because it's like washed off already but i'm just gonna take this luxie brush and blend out the outer edges nice and neat now you guys know that we're gonna blend that out so now we're gonna go into wild wing again which was our transition shade and pop that on the outer corner to blend everything together now taking angel baby on the same pencil brush and putting that on the outer corner right before that shade we just laid down and this just ties everything together and now for the shimmer shade i'm gonna go in to this one right here which is called sun flare i'm gonna go ahead and just swatch it for you guys I don't know if you guys can tell purple bluish pinkish reflex i'm gonna take that on the colourpop e3 brush which is a flat brush i wonder if this will be good to cut your concealer i'm not sure but i'm just gonna go ahead and pat this on the top of the concealer we're not done with the lid shade so we're gonna dip into this glitter right here because how can you not period this is the shade over pack it's gonna tap right on it and that's just gonna stick there and it's gonna be like a cute little sparkle still not done with the lid shade i'm gonna go into this super shock shadow so this is the shade flying circus it's like this shimmer shade but like on a whole nother level and it's perfect it goes with the look and all tap it right on as well 
before you guys come at me you know asking me where did i get these little butterflies from i got them for my nail tech my nail tech came yesterday she's the same one that i did the video on if you don't know what i'm talking about i did do a nail vlog um supporting a smaller business she's a nail artist that's just starting out and i decided to book her and you know see the talent that she brings she was really good as you guys seen in that video so i guess she's like my nail tech now and i got my nails done again from her and this is how they look christmas came a little early i was originally supposed to put some like type of white butterflies on my nails but it went the christmas way so i really didn't feel like putting butterflies on my nails if i was doing like a christmas kind of um look i guess so long story short she had these open and i was like girl i don't think i'm gonna use those like you can put those away before they all spill and right when i said that she literally spilled them and i was like hold the fuck up like i can use these to make a look as soon as she left i literally grabbed my tweezers and i picked those babies up and i put them in like a little container that i had and now i have some white butterflies i'm looking to buy more so if you guys are interested in buying them they are off of amazon and they're usually used for nails but fuck it <laughs> so i'm gonna go ahead and take my lash glue and put a dot right where I want the butterfly at. Now I'm gonna grab the butterfly on the tweezer. I am obsessed. Oh my god, I cannot wait to finish my full face. Anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and move to my lashes and I'm gonna use the Flutter and Love lashes and the style luna and they go perfect with the look so i'm gonna go ahead and put these babies on i do have a promo code with flutter and love which is emmy and Anais. make sure to go ahead and use that at checkout to save off some money all right so we are back in action and now i'm gonna go ahead and prime and prep my face for some foundation i'm gonna be using the colourpop pretty fresh hydrating hyaluronic acid <laughs> acid primer i'm gonna go ahead and shake this because if you don't i find that it comes out very watery and then when you shake it it just it comes out very nice and thick and that's how we like it so i'm gonna go ahead and just pump that i usually use like one pump is enough because it's very 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 hydrating and now instead of going in with my josie marin i'm gonna go in with the pixie skin treats glow tonic serum i forgot i had this i used to love this so much until i met the josie marin argan oil but girl i haven't used it in so long today came in my i bought these like little clear organizers for my alex drawers because i haven't had any at all so my makeup was legit everywhere and it was driving me nuts and i'm a virgo so you know you know that a mess gives us very heavy ocd so i'm gonna go ahead and use the peter thomas raw skin to die for reducing redness treatment primer so one thing I've been doing lately is just letting the primer and all of the skincare just like sit in for like at least five minutes. I just find that, you know, my foundation applies way better like that anyways. So I'm going to do that and I'll be right back. So we're back and my face is feeling nice and prepped. Now I'm going to go ahead and use the Maquillage Woke Up Like This foundation. This is in the shade 095 and I'm also going to be dipping in to the Anastasia Beverly Hills Luminous Foundation in the shade 340C. I'm going to mix these two together because one is way too light and then one is way too dark. And I'm at this like weird, I guess, skin tone right now because it's like I'm losing my tan from the summer and then I'm like, like not so it's kind of just all over the place right now so i'm just gonna mix these two together i really really love the il maquillage foundation i've seen you guys ask questions on it before like how does it perform and i love it lose my face looking like flawless but it's a nice full coverage layer like you can add and build up the coverage if you want i'm gonna move on to concealer Oh my god, I've been trying to do this. Oh, I just scratched off all the foundation. Oh, that itched so much though. Alright, so now for concealer, I've been using the ColourPop Pretty Fresh Hyaluronic Acid Concealer. I love it. This is in the shade Medium 90W. Oh my god, doing this is, oh, feels so good because it itches right there. ColourPop's concealers. Like even the no filter concealer i believe it's called and this concealer right here bomb makeup is like my therapy makeup and music my heart so now to contour i'm going to be using the colourpop pretty fresh contour contour concealer in the shade 
Dark 158W. So lately I've been placing my contour very high up, like normally way high up than where I usually place it. And I love the way it leaves my face like looking so snatched. Like look at my cheekbone. First of all, what cheekbone, period. I'm like shocked at how my skin looks right now. I'm gonna go ahead and use the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder. I ran out of this, but I was able to get some on the cap. So that's why I have it like this. Girl, it was like 30 minutes of me smacking this powder. With Airspun lately, I've been noticing that it's been leaving me like a pink, rosy, kind of like tint on my face i don't really know why or why i'm just starting to notice that it gives me that kind of like look so right now i'm on the hunt for a really good loose like face powders so if you guys know any good face powders besides like the ones that i'd be mentioning then let me know in the comments down below so as i mentioned i organized my drawers today and i bumped into this guy like who remembers Girl, this is the Wet n Wild's Mega Glow Contouring Palette in the shade 705A Caramel Toffee. Let's see what brush is in here to contour. Ooh, I'm gonna take this one. Let me see. Ooh, this is perfect. Okay, so I'm gonna use the ColourPop F20 brush and I'm just gonna use this to contour up my face. I was about to use, like, you know, my regular brush. Totally forgot. So back when I used to use this palette, I used to take the banana shade and my sponge and just go like that. And that right there is going to sharpen up your contour to a whole other level. I'm going to go ahead and use this blush. I'm scared. Um, this is the Buxom Wonderless Primer Infused Blush in Mykonos. I've used every single shade except for this one, so I'm going to show love. <laughs> To this blush and I'm gonna take that on the ColourPop F21 brush these are so pigmented like so pigmented oh wow I don't know if you guys can tell how perfect this brush is for blush like you can go right along your contour and just swipe up and because it's angled it helps so much so now I'm going to go in with this brush, which is the F18 brush, which is the biggest brush in here. And I'm just going to dust... Oh my god, this feels so soft. I'm just going to dust all that powder away and make sure everything is blended out. Now I'm going to go ahead and take this CoverGirl Easy Breezy Brow. I've been loving their brow gel. Like That's all I've been using for the past month. All the powders and stuff get caught... In your brow hairs and it makes your brow hairs look way lighter now we're gonna move on to highlight and i'm gonna be using the positions formula butter highlighter haven't used this in a while and it also broke on me so i'm gonna use the e21 brush to highlight my nose Let's see how this goes so to go with the whole look i'm gonna put white in my waterline and this is the color pop cream gel liner in the shade exit i have like lipstick all over i don't even know how i was time for the lips which i'm excited for they sent over this little cute bundle of lipsticks it's like lipstick set it's the come fly with me ColourPop lipstick set it has the same exact packaging and then on the back it has the names of each lipstick look at this shade this is a beautiful nude this is more like a wine shade. I'm living, period. This is like a cute rosy pink shade. I'm gonna be using this mini lip liner. This is the Plump Line Lip Liner in Hush Hush by Buxom. Now I'm gonna go in with the shade Bloom to Bloom. I'm also gonna apply this gloss. This is the Buxom full on plumping lip cream in the shade white russian so we're basically done i'm just gonna use this this is the color pop fly by pixie puff highlighter girl Ooh. 
I'm excited, okay? I opened this and I was like, are you shitting me? I feel bougie. First of all, I've been wanting one of these for so long. With the little freaking puff, like what? And it says color pop, like how cute. And then it just comes like this. It has a sticker on the loose powder. Let me take it off of the squeezer so I don't fuck up my nail. Hold up. Girlfriend. I wore a off the shoulder shirt just for this girl. Just for this. Oh wow. Girl, give me a second. Can y'all see the shine? I don't even know if y'all can see the shine on me. Girl, look at that freaking shoulder. All right, guys. Well, this is the completed look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was super fun for me to even play with this collection. I'm super grateful, first off, that I can even get my hands on such a beautiful collection. I'm obsessed with everything. I have nothing bad to say at all. I, I'm, I'm speechless. This look is so freaking pretty. The eyeshadows always just wow me. The pigmentation, the blendability, everything is amazing. I do know that they're having a 30% off sale at this moment. And I also think they're going to have like a Black Friday sale. So be on the lookout for that, girl. Because this collection bomb they did it again and i am not surprised so now to move on to the giveaway i'm going to be giving away of course one of the items from this whole collection this is the super shock color pop eyeshadow in the shade like a butterfly it's the super cute pretty pretty like cranberry burnt shade i don't even know how to explain it and it also has like little reflexes of like rose gold so pretty i'm also going to be giving away a wonderlust blush this is the primer infused blush like the same one i used but in dolly i'm also going to be giving away this pixie head to toe glowy powder in the shade fetch and then to top it all off you guys are going to be winning this buxom gold mine lip set it brings two full size lip plumpers and also a lip liner like the one that i use like the mini one that i use <laughs> now moving on to the rules number one of course to make sure you go ahead and like this video number two is to make sure to subscribe and turn on your bell notifications please make sure you turn on your bell notifications do not forget that part do not forget any part third is to go ahead and follow me on instagram and just spam my socials so you can just run down my instagram like the pictures comments whatever you want to do spam my socials as well as my snapchat my snapchat is always in the description box down below and then for youtube you guys can just watch my videos if you would like like it all of that stuff i will be checking so please don't try to play me i check all the time and once you're done with that the last step is to come back to this video and make sure you comment done this part is crucial because this is how i will be basically like raffling the comments and picking one random winner from the comments and then once i pick the winner i will run down and check if you guys did everything on the list so make sure to go ahead and comment done when you are and that is it i'll see you guys in my next one bye